Hi everyone, I thought I'd just make a short podcast to explain um, the S'more Stoichiometry Lab. Uh, since it was due earlier and I think uh, a couple people may have had, been having issues since we didn't have class to talk about it. So um, the first thing that you need is your data from the lab and you took the mass of a marshmallow of three different marshmallows and then you should have averaged it. So the average is simple, just add up the three masses that you got from the different marshmallows, divide by three and that's your average mass of a marshmallow unit. Um, if you recall, we said um, a graham cracker was going to be um, just like one of the half sheets. So if you go up to the top of the lab um, and, and take a peek up here, the one graham cracker is the half sheet of graham cracker. So you should have taken the mass of three of those, averaged it to find the average mass of graham cra cracker. And then um, the chocolate pieces were the smallest little pre-cut like cut, uh, little chocolates. So you had three of those, you took the mass and, and found the average. Um, the last row of the, the data table is your mass of your s'more. So you're gonna use your average masses um, for that. Uh, let me get a pen here. So you have one marshmallow, the mass of one marshmallow, um, average mass of a graham cracker and average mass of a chocolate piece. Um, with a s'more, you have two graham crackers. So we'll take two times 7.506. And your numbers are not gonna be exactly this, um, but they'll be somewhere close. I just made these numbers up actually. Um, plus you have one marshmallow, so we can do one times 5.761 plus three times 3.512. Okay, so that's the way you are gonna calculate the mass of one s'more on average. So let me do that quick on my calculator. Maybe we should have done that before making the video, but we'll just roll with it right now. In the future, I will. If, if we do do this in the future, I'm not sure what they're going to have us do um, with the new announcement that we're out through April. Plus three times 3.12. Oops made a typo, of course, as I'm trying to do this. Okay, so two times 7.506 plus uh, the marshmallow mass plus three times 3.512. And we get um, about 31.31. Um, that's close. Um, for my made up numbers, most of them should be, they should be around 32. Um, okay, so that's our average mass of a s'more. You'll notice that I rounded to uh, four significant digits.